Good morning. Today I'm going to pray for anyone who has lymphoma or leukemia. So just agree with me in prayer and receive the prayer as I speak it. Okay, Heavenly Father, Lord, we magnify your name. Lord, we glorify you. Lord, we thank you that you knitted our bodies together, Lord God. You saw that they were good. You knitted us in our mother's wombs, Lord God. And we thank you, Lord, that everyone listening to this prayer is worthy of your love, no matter what they have done in this life, no matter what their ancestors have done, their parents, their grandparents, Lord God, it doesn't matter. Because through repentance, we can come boldly. We can receive the finished work of Christ and come boldly to your throne of grace. So mighty God, we lift up the hearer of this prayer right now before you, who has received a diagnosis of lymphoma, leukemia, mycosis, fungoides, whatever the case may be, the cancer of the blood and lymph system. And mighty God, right now, we receive your word that says that healing is on bread. We receive your word, mighty God, that says that if we abide in you and your word abides in us, that we can ask for what we want and we shall have it. So mighty God, right now, I, stand, I sit before you, Lord God, in agreement with the hearer of this prayer. And I speak over your body right now. I speak over your body right now in the name of Jesus Christ. I speak to your blood system right now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. And I command the marrow to come into alignment with the will of God for you to be healed. It is written that Jesus moved around from city to city and town to town, and he healed all who were sick. It is written that the Lord said, when asked, are you willing, if it is your will, make me heal? He said, I am willing. So Lord, we receive the finished work of Christ, the finished work of Christ and appropriate it to the hearer now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. We lay hold of the blood of Jesus and appropriate it to the hearer right now, to my brother or sister listening to this prayer right now. I release the power of the Holy Spirit to heal the healing virtue of the Holy Spirit into your body right now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Receive it. Receive right now the power of the Holy Spirit to move through your body right now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I speak into the marrow and I command the marrow of your body to begin to produce normal levels of blood cells. And I'm speaking to it now and commanding normal levels of white blood cells in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Every white blood cell that is out of alignment, I command you in the name of Jesus Christ, come back into alignment now, 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 come back into alignment in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I speak, I speak to every platelet and I command you to come back into alignment now. I command normal clotting factors in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I command normal hemoglobin and <clears throat> red blood cell levels now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Right now, normalize any white blood cell that has a level that is too high, I command you to drop like a stone back to normal now in the name of Jesus Christ. Right now, every white blood cell level that is high, back to normal now in the name of Jesus Christ. Every white blood cell level that is low, come back to normal now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Every malformed, mal-shaped white blood cell or white blood cell that is behaving in a way that is not normal, metabolizing abnormally, I command you to come back to normal metabolism and normal levels of cell division now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I command the nuclei of every cell in your body to behave normally now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I command your DNA to be restored to normal now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I speak over your liver 
and I command the liver to be the perfect normal size right now and perfect normal functioning in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I speak to your spleen and I command it to be normal size and I command it to function normally now in the name of Jesus Christ right now, right now. May the hand of God reach into your body and touch these areas. May your thymus gland be touched right now by the hand of God in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth and be normalized now. May you receive virtue into these organs now in the name of Jesus Christ. May the virtue of God and the power of the Holy Spirit move through these organs right now, right now in the name of Jesus Christ and may healing, healing, healing saturate your body now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I also speak into your digestive system, into your gut system now. And I command all the lymphoid tissue in there to function normally in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. In the entire gut system, function normally now. Every lymph node, I command you to come back to the perfect size and functioning. To lose all inflammation right now in the name of Jesus Christ. I speak to every toxin in your body and I command it to be neutralized and nullified now by the hand of God. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I speak to every germ that would have been the source or the trigger for this cancer right now. I speak to every trigger, every root of this disease and I uproot you now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Every virus that may be at the root of this disease, I command you to lose power right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Right now, you will forget what it is you are about. You will lose power to do what it is you are doing right now and be as a bit of debris which will be removed and taken out of the body. I command this and I release this now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I speak to every parasite that could be blocking lymph nodes and I command you to die out, dry up, dissolve, to be removed by fire in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. We command you to be flushed out of your body. We command it to be flushed out of your body right now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Every parasite, every fluke, every amoeba, every protozoa that is con contributing to this disease, receive the fire of God right now and be demolished in the name of Jesus Christ. We speak to every toxic effect of medication that has been received or has yet to be taken and we command that there be no toxicity in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. We command that any doctor who has diagnosed the Hera's disease will be astounded and dismayed by the rapid recovery, by your rapid recovery. We speak that your doctors will be shocked by how rapidly you have healed in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Receive it now. We come out of agreement with sickness in the name of Jesus. We speak to every bacteria and mycobacteria that may be at the root of your disease and we command them to lose power now, right now. Every germ under the sound of my voice that triggered this disease, I command you lose power now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I speak to fear. I speak to the spirit of fear right now. And I command fear to step out of you, to slip out of your soul right now and leave you in the name of Jesus Christ. I speak to worry and anxiety and I command that to step away from you now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I speak to unworthiness and hopelessness and I command that to leave, to depart from your soul now and your body now in the name of Jesus Christ. I command the effects of these emotions to be reversed in your body now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I command every damaged tissue, every devitalized tissue to heal now in the name of Jesus, either be removed or be replaced now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I speak to you, I speak to every part of your body where a hurtful memory, a painful memory is stored and I command the pain to be removed 
In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, I command those memories to receive the love of God right now, wherever they are stored, to receive the love of God right now, right now. Every area in your body where painful memories are stored, I command to receive the love of God right now and be neutralized. All pain from these memories be neutralized now in the name of Jesus Christ. All rejection, any abandonment, mighty God, powerlessness, self-condemnation, I command to slip out of the soul and the body of the hearer of this prayer right now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Father, I release your love over their souls. Wrap them now in your love, in your unconditional love, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Wrap May the Lord wrap you up in his unconditional love right now. May hope be restored to you now in the name of Jesus Christ. May peace, the peace of God that passes all understanding, be restored to you now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. May joy, the joy of fulfilling your purpose, be restored to you now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Father, I thank you that right now faith is arising in the hearer of this prayer. Faith is arising in the hearer of this prayer, even as this disease dries up out of their body right now. I rebuke lymphoma right now from your body. I rebuke leukemia right now from your body in the name of Jesus Christ. I rebuke mycosis fungoides or any other form of lymphoma. I rebuke myeloid leukemias and, and um, ATL and any other form right now in the name of Jesus. I rebuke it in Jesus' name. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, I speak to cancel every word curse, every word, every negative word spoken over you right now in the name of Jesus Christ. I cancel and break the power of those words off of your body, soul, and spirit now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I speak to every negative word that you have spoken even over yourself and I break the power of those negative words right now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Father, I stand with the hearer of this prayer right now. And we choose, Lord God, to forgive everyone who has ever hurt us, who has ever rejected us or done us wrong. We choose to forgive them completely now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Let nothing hinder the progress and power of these prayers, Lord. Lord, I release a blessing. We release a blessing to everyone who has ever hurt us, Lord. And even as we release a blessing to them, we allow ourselves to receive your blessings for us, Lord God. So every, every storage container that the enemy has stored up our blessings, we break the hinges off of those now. We break the doors off of them now in the name of Jesus Christ. And we command the blessings, your blessings, mighty God, to return to the here and now in the name of Jesus Christ. I speak over you now that you shall live and not die. You shall live to proclaim the works of the Lord. You shall live to give a testimony of your healing. You shall live to hear the doctor say, whatever you're doing, keep doing it. Father, I speak to the, the surrounding environment in the hero's body, mighty God, and even in their, their living environment. And I say, let everything align with healing in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, let their diet align with healing in the name of Jesus Christ. Let vitamin D levels supernaturally be restored in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Lead the hero, mighty God, out into the sunlight or if they're near to a beach or whatever is possible, Lord God. Lead them into the environment that will help them to heal best. Lead them to the food, mighty God, that will help them to heal best, mighty God. Lord, touch the appetite center of their brains, O oh God, in the name of Jesus Christ, and let them create the foods that will support their healing. 
I speak to the internal environment in their bodies and I command homeostasis and balance now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I command the fluids bathing every tissue to flow freely and be free from toxins now in the name of Jesus Christ. I speak healing into the lungs, brain, thyroid, um, into the spinal bones right now and into every bone in the body right now in the name of Jesus Christ. I speak healing over every joint in their bodies in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I speak healing into the digestive system in the areas of the liver, pancreas, um, gallbladder right now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I command every blockage in the body to be dissolved and demolished, to be roasted by fire now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Every blockage cease to block now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I command full oxygenation full oxygenation to flow through the veins in the name of Jesus Christ. Flow through every artery and vein of the here and now in the name of Jesus Christ. I command electrolytes to come into alignment with the will of God in your body now, right now, in the name of Jesus. I speak healing over your kidney system and reproductive system now. I command wholeness in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I command wholeness in your mus muscles right now and strength to your body in the name of Jesus Christ. I speak to your purpose and I locate it in the spirit realm and I call it forth and apply it to you now in the name of Jesus Christ. And I say, let your purpose arise and have an opportunity to shine in the name of Jesus Christ. I speak over you that your latter days will be greater than your former days. I stand with you now and I come out of agreement with this diagnosis. I disconnect our agreement with the diagnosis that has been given. We separate you from that diagnosis right now. And in the spirit realm, we tear up the paper, any paper, any lab on which it is written, that diagnosis along with your name. And we stamp it, we seal it with the blood of Jesus right now. We speak that this is what the doctor has diagnosed. But the truth of God says that if we believe, if we speak to mountains, right, and we command mountains to fall into the sea, they shall do as we have said. And therefore, we speak to the mountain of sickness right now, and we command that mountain to fall into the sea and be destroyed completely. We speak to that mountain of infirmity right now and we command it to melt like wax before the Lord in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. We release health and healing and wholeness to you now in the name of Jesus. I release vitality to you now in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord, I thank you that even now the hearer's body is a buzz with your healing, is alive and tingling and electrified with your healing touch right now, is trembling with your healing touch right now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Infirmity, leave now. Sickness, go now. You are not wanted and you are not supported. Pack your bags and go in the name of Jesus Christ. We reject this sickness now in the name of Jesus Christ. We reject this sickness now, like a package that comes by delivery, by FedEx, and we say, no, I will not sign for that. You will take that and you will drive away. So we decree that the enemy's package will not be received. We reject it now. We rebuke it now. We renounce it now in the name of Jesus. And we say, take it and go and never return in the name of Jesus Christ. It is written that we shall decree a thing and it shall be established. It is written that everything, anything is possible if we believe. And so we believe you are healed right now. And I would like you to listen to this prayer over and over and over and receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it wholeheartedly. Come into full agreement with it. And Lord, we thank you for your healing today. We thank you for your healing touch. We thank you for the power of the Holy Spirit, which has been flowing freely into, the, into my brother or sister's body right now. 
And I thank you, mighty God, for the love that you have for them and for the testimonies that will come of your healing touch. We thank you that your healing is available, Lord God. We thank you for your goodness. In Jesus' name, amen. If you like this video and want to see more like it, click the subscribe button and also click the notification bell. Now, if it is that you have someone who you know needs to hear this prayer, then please share the video with them. Also, if there is another health issue that you'd like me to pray for, leave a comment below and I'll be sure to make a video on that for you. Till next time, take care. Bye-bye.